Well, day two on this clearing job. Got a good bit cleared. Whenever I started today, everything from this tree towards me, way back down through, is all these uh, no sassafras. They're all pretty tall, just the whole way. Big old pile of them. But getting her opened up in here. Got about one more day of clearing. I'm not gonna walk the way back here, but that's the pile. It's getting pretty big. So, had to weld the thumb on this 305 today. And I just noticed it broke again. So, welded it right here. This was cracked. Got that gap to close up. And I welded it. And it actually broke again. Actually, this piece, it was cracked here and through here because this is a grease thing, so it's hollow. And I was able to weld it, but now it broke here, so. And I see it's cracked on this side, so. I'm gonna take this thing off and try to push this back together and weld some kind of plate across here to temporarily hold that together because kind of a major part of this job is using a thumb. This side is fine, but for whatever reason, that side cracked once and then now again. And also, I was just finishing up here and I ran this track off. Just kind of up on this hillside here. There's a back drag in it because it kind of makes it look a little nicer like that and this track come off on the front so I did get it back on because I didn't want it sitting there overnight with the idler sitting on this rubber and not in its metal shank that's supposed to be in so I gotta fill it back up with grease in the morning it's still loose but She's gonna live right there for the night. So, yeah, it's coming along. This thing, this is all a bunch of trees. It's thick. This part, this corner here, like all through here, is all kind of the thickest part. So, all this stuff, and this should get pretty fast tomorrow. But now I gotta work on this machine first. So. See you on the downfall. Alright, I'll give update tomorrow.